Hi, it's Gary Kay. We're here at Infocom 2016. We're here in the DNP booth. We're here with Johnny Jensen, Senior Product Manager of DNP. Johnny, how's the show been so far for you? So far it has been very, very good. Um, we had a lot of visitors on the first day and here second day also very successful. Well, you invented, DMP invented, the ambient light rejection screen technology, so a lot of people want to come in here and understand how this works, so you're going to give our, our uh, viewers a demo of exactly how this works. And we're going to start with a little demo screen that you have set up here. Yes, what we have... Oh. What we have here is uh, a, a matte white screen, could be from any manufacturer, and what we want to show here is what you can do if you replace that with this supernova screen material. So I have a piece of material here, so you will see what you instantly can get in improved contrast by using our supernova screen material technology. We have two different versions. We have a high gain version and a low gain version, and we have this sliding wall where I can show it. So this is a high gain version. The gain is 2.30, 2.3 gain, and the half gain angle is 23 degrees. If you want something which is even more uniform than this, we have the 0.8 gain material. So this has the full perfect color balance, ISF certified, 0.8 gain, 85 degrees half gain angle, so it has the perfect uh, uniformity. And you also, and, and this doesn't just come in the 110 inch size, obviously you're demonstrating 110 10 inches here, but it comes in all, all, you know, you can order it in any size you want for the most part, right? Correct. I mean, in, in one piece we can make it up to 120 inch in 16 by 9, which is the size that we show here next to the sliding wall in a supernova core screen. Uh, if we want to go bigger, we can also uh, laminate the, the screen materials together and then we have the next screen which is the Supernova XL, which is basically a giant size of the Supernova core. So it, it ships with the screen material rolled and you have to assemble the frame on site. Uh, but otherwise, I mean, it's, a, it's the same screen material, it's the same contrast you get. And then what about the, the screen up above us? It's, it's very, very thin. It almost looks like it's floating on the wall. What is that? Yeah, that's a, a very cool product, we believe. It's the Supernova Blade and Blade because it has this sharp, you know, uh, look. Um, here we hang it in wire. Uh, so you have this uh, virtually floating image. It is uh, the same screen material again, now laminated on a backboard, so that it is a rigid screen and it ships like this. Uh, so it's very, very easy to hang. Um, and again, you have the, uh, the very, very high contrast uh, that you get here, even though we have a lot of ambient light here in the booth. And what sizes is that available? Yeah, that one is available up to 120 inch and 16 by 9 again. But if you want something bigger with a hardboard surface or hardboard background, then we have this one, which is the Supernova Infinity Screen. And uh, you can almost tell from uh, the name that uh, we can build this screen to almost infinite size. This particular one's 180 inches. The name Infinity basically means that you can build it to any size that you need, right? Yeah, right, exactly. This configuration here is a 2x2 two two configuration, so we have four panels, but we can use as many panels as we want, grow it to any size you want. Right, and from here I can see the scenes, but when I was standing back, you can't see anything. Like you're only, only, you don't even, it's not really a scene, you see where the screen material is put together, but at a normal viewing distance you see nothing, and you can make it as big as you want. Exactly, and I guess our viewers, they cannot see the scene in the yes, video. No, no way. <laughs> No way. It's an interesting uh, technology that you have the capability of doing like that with. What's the largest rigid screen material you've ever built? What's who, who asked for the largest screen? Well, uh, yeah, I remember. Uh, <laughs> I will not uh, tell our, our, our client's name, but I can say that we have, uh, the, so far the biggest one we have made is a 608 inch diagonal. Wow. So that is 25 panels, you know, five in the height and five in the, uh, in the width. There are probably some that are that that are bigger, but they are they are wider right. and not so high. Yep. So, like for control room applications right. or something like that. Yeah. What was the application the screen was built for? Just out of curiosity. Yeah, well, we had make a, a couple of these, but uh, the one I'm thinking of was for houses of worship. Oh wow, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. So. Uh, 
Well, DNP, as I said, invented the technology of uh, ambient light rejection screens. Uh, of course, they're here at Infocom. They've been at ISD. They're at almost every show we go to. But you can see all the products that DMP has here at Infocom by going and typing in DMP in the search window. And we're also going to get another preview of another product as well in just a moment. Um, but uh, of course, you can check out DMP as well at D it's not DMP.com. What is your web address? Our web address is DNP screens.com. Yeah, dash screens.com. DNP screens.com. Johnny, thank you very much for joining me today. Thanks for taking the time to do this. And uh, thanks for watching.